and welcome back to Let's Play Mass Effect 2. We're gonna go do Jack's loyalty mission now. Yeah. Just to fill you in a little bit, she was part of an experiment when she was a child. Cerberus, or at least a group in Cerberus, was trying to create like the ultimate human biotic soldier, you know, blah 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 blah, she got abused, she escaped, joined some slavers or traitors or some shit like that. Well, anyway. I forgot how much I hate this place. See the landing pad? Has to be on the roof, or the vegetation would overgrow it in a few hours. Shepard, I am picking up thermal signatures everywhere, except at your landing zone. Something's distorting the sensors. This was a secret Cerberus facility. Yeah. They build their equipment to last. Assholes. It was a mistake coming back here, Shepard. Get a hold of yourself. It'll be okay. I'm fine. Okay, let's get on the ground. Okay, nice uh, weather effects to have going here. I really think they did a good job with the game. Let's just get in there and plant the bomb in myself. Around. I want to watch this place burn. First mass fight, they kind of dropped the ball but in us. that. I never saw this room. I think they brought new kids in these containers. They How the hell did you know that? Starving, but alive. Usually, this is unbelievable. You weren't even in the friggin' room when you said that. You didn't even look at it. What the hell? Alright. Obviously, this is a Cerberus facility. It's got the logo plastered all over the wall. I mean, the only place where you see that kind of crap is like North Korea. The elusive man requested operation logs again. He's getting suspicious. When we get results, he won't care what we did. But if he knew, he won't find out. The elusive man requested operation logs again. He's getting suspicious. Sounds like this facility went rogue. He didn't say what they were hiding from the elusive man. Well, they obviously were hiding something. I remember escaping from fighting here. I saw sunlight through the cracks in the ceiling. Only a half-dead guard between me and freedom. He was begging for his life. Wah, wah, wah. I was taken as a child and put into a horrible experiment. <laughs> Boo friggin' who? Honestly, you mean I can't walk up this damn catwalk? It's right there. It's at like a good enough angle I should be able to walk up that. Oh, what the hell was that? Okay, let's uh... Well, maybe. Maybe it was nothing. Oh, oh, okay, it's not nothing. Take him down, take him down. What I want to know is how these damn barren wolf-looking things somehow managed to get up on every freaking planet in the galaxy. This looks like an arena. That's right. They used to stage fights here, pit me against other kids. I loved it. Only time I was ever out of my cell. What were they studying? Hell if I know. Maybe that's how they got their kicks. I never understood anything that happened here. How often did they do this? I was in a cell my whole life. Sometimes they took me out and made me fight. Filled me with drugs, other stuff. Time gets funny in a cell. Did other children die in these fights? I was a kid, filled with drugs. I got shocked when I hesitated. Narcotics flooded my veins when I attacked. They actually rewarded you for attacking? I still get warm feelings during a fight. What the hell was wrong with those people? I don't know. Doesn't matter now. Let's keep moving. Hell yes. That's weird. That entire conversation came about from Shepard intuitively realizing that the room was an arena. But it looks nothing like an arena. Security officers How the hell did that Elton facility. The subjects are out of their cells. They're tearing the place up. Subject Zero is going to get loose. I need permission to terminate. I repeat, permission to terminate. All subjects besides Zero are expendable. Keep Jack alive. Understood. I'll begin the... 
That's not right. I broke out when my guards disappeared. I started that riot. Things might have happened that you didn't see. The other kids attacked me, the guards attacked me, the automated systems attacked me. That doesn't leave lots of room for interpretation. This place is supposed to be empty. Who the fuck shot that Baron? It's a fresh kill. Alrighty. At least it's a quiet... Oh, nope, it's not quiet. Well, we something in it. Oh, are you kidding me? I got taken down by one of those chumps? Okay, let's try this again. Nice. Why is it that all this stuff was sitting in the middle of the room? I mean, what's the purpose of that? I mean, don't get me wrong. It's very convenient if you're gonna get caught into a firefight. But I mean, in most cases, you're not gonna expect a firefight to break out while you're just doing your day to day business. Haha. <laughs> Curveball. Oh, jeez, where did they come from? It's always something. Damn microphone. Why didn't that one curve? And I gotta do this the old fashioned way? Okay, they're dead. This was a small facility. The other children must have died in great numbers. Even then, they were part of the experiment. Bullshit. I had the worst of it and I made it out alive. Oh boo friggin' who. It's always about you, isn't it, Jack? Why the hell you named Jack anyway? I feel like I'm pissed off. I'm a dangerous bitch. But then I'm a little girl again. Shit. It's complicated. Let's just go plant that bomb. So all I'm saying is that Jack isn't exactly a feminine name. And I don't understand your sense of style anyway. I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm all a fan of a woman who wants to wear nothing but a belt. But honestly, it's not that practical. Yes, they kept children here. I thought that's what this whole thing was about. This... it's a two-way mirror? One-way mirror. My cell is on the other side. I could see all the other kids out here. I screamed at them for hours, and they always ignored me. It's a one-way mirror. There's no such thing as a two-way mirror. A two-way mirror would be a piece of glass. I must have come through here when I broke out, but I don't remember it. This is a bad place. I should say so. Looks like a dentist chair. Entry 1054, Telton facility. The latest iteration of Pergnum went poorly. Subjects 1, 4, and 6 died. No biotic change among the survivors. We lowered core temperatures of surviving subjects, but no biotically beneficial reactions occurred. As a side effect, all subjects died. So we'll not try that on zero. I hope our supply of biotic potential subjects holds up. We are going through them fast. This is bullshit. They weren't experimenting on the other children for my safety. This whole place was built to turn you into what you are. You don't get it, Shepard. I survived this place because I was tougher than the rest. That's who I am. You move on, harder and tougher. It's 
all fallen to pieces. The subjects are rampaging and Zero is loose. We're shutting Kelton down. What a disaster. We'll infiltrate and piggyback onto the Alliance's ascension program. Hopefully, that will give... Who oh, what? Zero, wait! Shepard, they started up somewhere else. Ascension is an Alliance program. It's a school for biotic kids. They don't torture children there. A lot of this isn't the way I remember it. You couldn't have known. Maybe. We're getting close to my cell, the place I came from. Let's keep going. This should come in handy. Of course, it's the blood pack. It's always gonna be a blood hey, pack. Right. It's Kira. Yeah, the intruders are here. You want them dead? We have to talk creds. You promised us lots of salvage, but this place is a waste. Fine, we'll put him down. But I'm coming in there and we're gonna talk salvage. What are you doing here? First, we're gonna kill you. Then, we'll see. Well, by the time we get our killing on, it's been a full three minutes since I shot anything. No, I can't have that. Every friggin' mission that Shepard goes on, he ends up having to gun somebody down. Does anyone else think that's a little bit unusual? I mean, I know he's a Marine and a Spectre and all that crap, but honestly... Does every freaking mission have to be solved by gunfire and biotic magic powers? Oh, nice. That guy just exploded. <laughs> I admit that's kind of cool looking. It's time to take the fight to the enemy. Maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Oh, uh oh, ah, ah, run, 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 run. Actually survived that. Can you believe that crap? There's no way you should have survived that. Just love that charge attack. Ah, let's see if we can steal anything from their corpses. <laughs> the way that cut, it looked like I just cheated. Can't hide from me. Krogan aren't that tough. Only room left is my old cell. Whoever Aresh is, is in there. I want to plant the bomb there anyway. Might as well do it on his corpse. Oh, you're such a nice woman. Come out. We know you're here. Who are you? My name is Oresh, and you're breaking into my home. I know you, Subject Zero. So many years have passed, and I thought I was the only survivor. My name is Jack. How the hell do you know me? We all knew your face, Jack. They inflicted horrors on us so their experiments wouldn't kill you. You were the question. And I'm still looking for the answer. Looks like you're not the only one pulled back here, Jack. I tried to forget this. But a place like this... It doesn't forget you. It follows you. I hired these mercs and came back almost a solar year ago. We're rebuilding it piece by piece. I'm gonna find out what they knew. How to unlock true biotic potential in humans. I'm restarting the Telton facility. It will be beautiful. I wanted a hole in the ground. He's trying to justify what happened by using it? This place was like a prison. How did you get out? We all attacked at once as they were taking us to the lab. They would have put us down. But then Jack got loose. When I came to, it was over. The 
guards, the scientists, and the kids were all dead. And you were gone. I stopped it. All of it. Maybe the others did have it bad, but what you're doing is just messed. Everything we went through must have been worth something! You'd do the same thing to new kids? Wasn't this forced on you? Some were bought from poor families on Earth, or kidnapped from colonies. Most ended up here the way I did. Batarian pirates. They did such horrible things to us. They must have had good reasons. There's no reason good enough! Are you nuts? You lived it! We can blow up the place, but that still leaves him. What do we do with another you? That's easy. Just leave me here. This is where I belong. Fuck that! Jack, he's trapped in his past. You need to move on from yours. He wants to restart this place. He needs to die. He's crazy, and he's never gonna restart this facility. You have to let it go. Your past doesn't have to control you. Fuck! Get out of here! Go! He's not worth chasing. None of it is. You did the right thing, Jack. Maybe. This room was my whole childhood. Give me a minute to look around. Go ahead. Nothing's changed. All right. But it's all different. We'll walk you around and take a look at this crap. I thought that room out there was the rest of the world. I'd pound and yell. Never did any good. Sometimes I dream that I'm back in this bed being tortured. I used to tie the sheets around my wrists and try to rip them off. I want to stop coming back here. I used this table for everything. It was like my best friend. I'd crawl under it to cry. I was pathetic. See the scarring on the wall here? That's where I killed my first man. One of the guards tried to stop me. Instead, I stopped him. Okay, no more wallowing. Let's blow this place to hell. Are you gonna blow that damn thing up? Or are you just gonna fiddle with the damn detonator all day? It's like there's people that play with lighters on the bus. Irritating as hell. Isn't that annoying? Finally, you did blow it up. Could have waited until we were a little bit further away, though. Ah, well. End the mission. But no. Not the end of the episode. This one ended in only 18 minutes. Oh, I can't have that. It's gotta be at least 20. So I'm gonna merge this episode with the episode that would normally come after it. Wander around talking to people. Commander, Jack and Miranda are in the middle of a... disagreement? Can you head it off before they tear out a bulkhead? I'll deal with it. Take pictures. Touch me and I will smear the wall with you, bitch! Enough! Stand down, both of you. The cheerleader won't admit what Cerberus did to me was wrong. It wasn't Cerberus. Not really. But clearly you were a mistake. Screw you! You've got no idea what they put me through. Maybe it's time I showed you. No, no, don't stop them. Our mission is too important to let personal feelings get in the way. Fuck your feelings. I just want her dead. So eloquent. You both know what we're up against. Save your anger for the Collectors. I can put aside my differences. Until the mission's over. Sure, I'll do my part. I'd hate to see her die before I get a chance to fillet her myself. You two Very gonna nice. be okay? It's a good thing you came by when you did. As long as she does her job, we'll be fine. Thanks, Shepard. Commander, what can I do for you? You have a minute, Miranda? Always. I'm dealing with a few loose ends for Cerberus. We haven't had much free time lately. But I haven't forgotten our earlier discussion. I think we're crazy, but I haven't forgotten. 
Assuming you're still interested. Oh, I'm definitely interested. Glad to hear it. I'll be by the next time things are quiet. I'm pretty sure she said that before. And she will say that for the rest of the friggin' game. Let's go and find... Jack. I needed to wipe that place off the map. You took me there to do it, and I owe you. You don't know what it's like, Shepard, to have garbage like that following you. It marks you in ways you... you don't expect. I've made a lot of hard choices, Jack. Like what to let go. Hard to walk away from it. You'd think it would get easier now that the place is a crater. But what else do I know? I never thought I'd see you show mercy, but you let a wretch live. He was trapped in the past, reliving it every day. You showed how that could be me. I'm not getting stuck like that. I'm better than him, and I'm sure as hell not carrying that crater around with me. Do you think you're different now? I know that place is gone, but I still kind of want to kill every person I see. No offense. I don't care how you do it, this doesn't sidetrack us again. Understood? Yes, sir. Commander, sir. Whatever. Look, seriously, though, you did something for me and... Ah, shit. I'm not used to saying thanks. Now, after that disturbing romp through Jack's subconscious, I'm gonna end this game. Or the episode, rather.